This is my all-time favourite recipe. It's lemon chicken with cauliflower couscous and it's perfect this time of year. So, first things first, in with the onion, the garlic and the ginger. And we're just going to cook them for a couple of minutes until the onion is lovely and translucent. Saffron, oh, it's really one of my favourite spices. And no wonder it's called the queen of spices. It's got a real unique depth of flavour, it's quite magical. And the best thing is that you only need a tiny, tiny pinch. Another really important part to this recipe are these preserved lemons. They are absolutely delicious and add a really lovely citrus flavour, much more intense than a normal lemon because of the way that they're preserved. And the great thing is you can eat the whole thing. And these just need to be finely chopped. So now we are going to add the chicken. We are using breast and thigh. We're going to add the thigh in first because it takes slightly longer to cook and also because it's on the bone it's going to give that really lovely chickeny flavour. So when they're nice and golden on one side you just want to flip them over and get them nice and brown on the other side. Right, so now that's looking lovely, we're going to add the stock. And then just pop the lid on. And we're going to let that cook slowly for about 20 minutes. So the second pan is on, we've just popped a little bit of oil in there. Now we're going to add the chicken breasts. We want to just gently seal them on each side and this is really going to hold in the moisture and make them lovely and tender. So now they are looking gorgeous and golden, we're going to add them to the pot. They need to just cook together for around another 20 minutes until the chicken is tender. Just enough time for you to cook the cauliflower rice. Roughly chop the cauliflower and place it all in a food processor. Then blitz until it resembles rice. That all goes into a bowl. And add some salad onions. Add about 25 grams of sultanas. The juice of a whole lemon. A drizzle of oil. And some seasoning. Give it a really good stir. Then place the sheet of foil on a baking tray and put the cauliflower mix onto the foil. Now fold over the edges to create a little parcel. This will allow it to steam in the oven. Next, pop it in the oven and cook for about 20 minutes. Then you're all ready to serve it with a sprinkling of sunflower seeds and some chopped coriander.